Here I'm going to overview how to use the point averaging uh, function in Field Genius for Android. Uh, the first thing I'm going to do is just set uh, my code. Uh, so I'm just going to set this to control nail. And the next thing I want to do is just update uh, my point series. Uh, since I will be using this as a control point, I'm just going to set my point series to 5000 uh, just to differentiate uh, between uh, my observed measurements and control points. And I'll take my first measurement. And once the first observation is stored, I'll just re-enter uh, back in uh, to edit my point, and I'm going to set that back to 5,000. And I'll just hit OK. And I will now take my second observation uh, for the average. Uh, so once you take that second observation, uh, you will get uh, the new point duplicity dialog uh, that appears. And I'll just mention that point 5,000 already exists. And it's just going to ask if you want to use the next available point name or if you want to overwrite uh, the point to update uh, with the new um, observation details or average. Uh, so I'll just select average. And up on the top, uh, you'll see the average point uh, 5,000 and uh, the current uh, position, comp computed position um, information and standard deviations uh, for reference. And down below, uh, are uh, each individual observation used uh, to compute uh, the averaged uh, result. Uh, so if this all looks fine, I'm just going to hit save. And that does save averaged uh, 0.5 thousand uh, because I do want to add another observation uh, just to add some uh, redundancy. I am just going to add a third shot uh, to my average. And I'll just select average again. And now you'll just see the updated uh, average comp computation. And you'll also see uh, the additional uh, third point uh, that was added um, at the top of the list there. Uh, so once you have more than uh, two observations um, in the point averaging computation, uh, you will have options to either not use um, selected observation in the computation and it does dynamically um, update uh, the average computation uh, point uh, for reference. And you can also uh, delete the point after you've removed it if it is something you do want to uh, remove from uh, the computation altogether. Uh, but I'll just set this back in uh, so that it is included and I'll just save. <laughs> And if I just enter back into my uh, project data and into my points, if I just scroll down, uh, so you'll see 0.5,000. And you'll notice that it does have an averaged um, icon there just to differentiate uh, the point. And if we just hit this drop down toggle, uh, you can also review uh, the child uh, points that were used to compute. Uh, the average point. And that is how you use uh, the new point averaging uh, feature.